Bone is a living tissue, and throughout life it undergoes a continuous cycle of being broken down and replaced with new bone. This process, known as bone remodeling, is important for keeping our bones strong and healthy. Bone remodeling depends on two types of cells, called osteoclasts, which break down bone, and osteoblasts, which form new bone. The activity of the osteoclasts and osteoblasts is controlled by chemical signals they and other bone marrow cells, such as stromal cells, release. Normally, the chemical signals are balanced so that their activity is the same, meaning that the rate of bone breakdown and bone formation is the same and bone mass remains constant. In myeloma, the myeloma cells produce their own chemical signals, disrupting the balance of signals between the osteoclasts, osteoblasts and stromal cells. This results in an increase in the activity of the osteoclasts and a decrease in the activity of the osteoblasts, so that bone is broken down faster than it's being made. The bone therefore becomes thinner and much weaker. If you have myeloma bone disease, you will probably have some degree of bone pain. You may also have one or more of the following, hypercalcemia or high calcium levels in your blood as it's released from the bone, lytic lesions or areas of bone thinning which often appear as holes on an x-ray, bone fractures and vertebral compression fractures when the bones of the spine become so weakened they collapse upon themselves. Treatment for myeloma bone disease involves treatment of the myeloma itself together with other treatments such as bisphosphonates, painkillers and radiotherapy.